what sucks is this is probably going to be how most videos start, if not all of them, as far as Frontiers is concerned. By the looks of things, it's probably going to take me like four or five videos per island. Well, maybe not per island, but yeah, it's definitely going to take me a while. Anyways, uh, this video, uh, since I subscribe to the Frontiers newsletter, as you can see, we're rocking them Adventure 2 shoes. <sighs> Real quick, because there are two things literally right here, and it's easier to get them out of the way now instead of later. Oh, yes, it's nighttime right now. I came at the exact right moment. Is there any more? I know, there are two more over here. There we go. Yeah, that's one thing that does kind of suck a lot of the nighttime puzzles you end up finding well, when it's daytime, so that fucking sucks. Anyways, um. Let's work this thing. Uh, let's mark this one on the map, and today we're gonna be getting those chaos emeralds that I've been putting off. Although my. No, wait, uh, no way, I have to fist to get the Chaos Emeralds. Oh, it's right here! I might as well go ahead and grab- Oh, there's an Amy right there. I'll get at the Emerald, talk to Amy. Then be on my way to that little challenge thing. And... It's probably not going to be next episode, if I'm honest, but hopefully... Next episode, and if not then, 100% most likely the episode after that. We will do, um... Come on, let me talk to you. Is there a fucking... Just... Hey, I'm trying to talk to my girlfriend here. Bitch. Couldn't even give me an XP. Anyways. What were you saying? Which Frontiers had more outfits you could unlock? So, something's been bugging me about these ruins. The whole reason we came was because Tails mm. detected the Chaos Emeralds were drawn here, right? And now I'm finding digital keys and confinement towers that seem custom-made to hold the Emeralds. Like half this stuff was built with them in mind. Maybe ancients used the Chaos Emeralds in the past. We've learned of other past civilizations who did too. Yeah, but those groups tried to use them. The stuff here seems all about containment. Maybe they knew something about their power that we don't. The Chaos Emeralds are still pretty mysterious, even after all we've done with them. Yeah, yeah that's true. And I will never for forget over the fact that IDW still barely uses the Chaos Emeralds. Like they used them once at the end of the whole Metal Virus saga when Sonic and Silver went super, which was fucking insane. I remember being so hyped over that. But ever since then, the Emeralds haven't even shown up. Let, let alone even been mentioned. Let alone even name dropped. I'm just seeing Gigi. Oh, wait, is this gonna be one of those fucking ball- Aw, oh, damn, it's a ball ball zone. At least it's an easy one. Oh, let's line her up. There we go. I fucking hate these ball puzzles. Y you'll see what I mean once we get onto the later islands. Some of them just seem like fucking bullshit half the time. Alright, we got that emerald. It wants to talk to Amy, but there's another side quest mission, whatever you want to call them over here. I know this is itchy. Oh, this is, um, it's a tile puzzle. I remember, um, I made a post on Twitter. You should go follow, by the way, on, um,. Whenever I started playing Rise of Lyric again, I got to one of those tile puzzles and I was like, Hey guys, take a look at this leaked footage of Frontiers I found. 
Oh, man. That was before I had my tripod, and oh, it was cringy. You see, that's one reason why I want to go ahead and get all of these uh, things. Um, that's one reason why I want to go ahead and get fast travel enabled, because as far as my knowledge goes, there is no way to actually unlock uh, or get to that cyberspace portal over there. Yes, that is all you have to do if you want infinite boost in this game. Just make like a figure eight. Okay. What are you wanting me to do here, Sega? Oh. Oh, I just gotta run over there. That's easy. Oh, shit. I got distracted. Uh, shit. Where am I? Where, where am I going again? Oh, yeah. Over here. An email right there again. Is that the objective? I think that was the objective I just ran by. I mean, no wonder it confused me, because I don't remember Amy being there. I remember around in this area, there was an Amy that I had to talk to. Or that I didn't have to talk to, but there was an optional Amy that was kind of bullshit to find, because he had to like, yeah, it was like right up there. And it was just another time puzzle right here. Where does this one want me to go? Okay. I'm never gonna actually get to my objectives, are I? Probably not. There we go, with several seconds to spare. How are you guys enjoying Frontier so far in both my coverage and in general gameplay? God damn it. There are things everywhere. Oh well, the faster I unlock fast travel, the faster I can go, I guess. Best I get, get them all done as quick as possible. So I don't have to do them later and waste time. There we go. Besides, at least the majority of them for Kronos Island are super simple. And they're saved right there, but I know if I probably talk to them, I'm probably going to end up... If I know I talk to too many of... Ah, oh, I need five more. Shoot. Oh, that wouldn't be that hard to go and find five more. Um, memory token. Wouldn't be that hard to find five more. Come on, step on it. But, um, I know it's probably going to make it harder to talk to the any objectives if I keep, you know, using them. There's an Amy right there, too. Damn it. Oh. Okay, thankfully I don't need any more to talk to Amy. Like I said, that, uh, what they give you if you got the pre-order, you basically have enough just to do everything within Chrono Island. Like, they give you way more than what you need for this game. As far as keys and everything else goes, you can get way more than what you need. Hang in there, Amy. What's your condition? I don't know, uh, uncomfortable. It's certainly unsettling. But it makes a big difference being able to at least talk to you. Before you freed me, I couldn't see or hear anything clearly. It was like looking into a kaleidoscope that was always shifting. I couldn't tell if I was coming, going, or moving at all. I'd have gone crazy if you hadn't gotten me out. You're tough. I know you'd have hung in there. Still, I'm glad I could get you out. And I'm not going to stop until you're back to normal. 
yeah. Alright, quickly grab all these rings. Just to, you know, go ahead. Oh man. Literally just a little bit away from being totally decked out. Oh, I probably have enough to talk to Sage now. Where is she? She's right here. Go talk to her real quick. You can let me still, because I met you. Four more? Oh, it's probably because I talked to Amy. Damn it. Well, even then, I don't care. Because I can always come back to it. That is something that's very easy to do. I have 31 casts on the keys. I'm never going to need one, at least for Chronos. How long have we been going? 11 minutes now. I know there's the Monster, Monster Hunter uh, DLC that's supposed to be coming out soon. I don't think I'm going to use that whatsoever because it looks fucking stupid on Sonic. And to be honest, like, again, like, I know, uh, cutscenes that really matter, they'll automatically turn off your cosmetics, but... Uh, the draft is kind of useless. No? Come on, get it, go get it, Sonic. There you go, boy, there you go, good boy. Also, um, the games that these cyberspace levels pull from are Generations Unleashed Adventure 2, uh, Zone, Unleashed Adventure 2 Generations. I feel like there's one more game that they pull from that I'm forgetting for some reason. Is it four or is it only those three? I think it's only those three. I might be wrong. But yeah, Adventure 2, Unleashed, and Generations of the levels that the server stages pull from for level designs. I mean, at least it's good level design. Like, if they pull from forces, I'd be kind of disappointed, you know. Again, there were some good forces levels, and they would probably fit the aesthetic for how the cyberspace levels are set up more. But, eh. Again, at least these are really good level layouts. How close was I? Oh, I could have gone. I could get it. I could. But I'd rather not. I'm not going to worry about it. Again. I think that's it. That's that's the entire oh, some of these training missions they want to do, they're just kinda uh, they're kinda a bit simple, but then again those, these are literally just high score feed things. I'm gonna skip skip I'm gonna go and talk to Ah oh, damn it, there's another thing right there. This is a good way to get XP. Just farm flying enemies. Oh, I wish you they allowed you to just collect everything they dropped like instantly. And like kinda not needed when you can just literally like run up everything. Oh yeah, that's the puzzle that's locked. Is it? There seems to be a puzzle over here I can do, it's a time machine. Cool. I love how a lot of the rails and attempt to keep the flow of the game going, um, they'll just like lead you to other challenges, like if you take the grind rails, 
they're gonna end up going to like the majority of challenges. As in like that's just where they end or something. Mitch, I do not have time for your way. No! Don't you dare. I am not doing that boss. Fuck that guardian. It's not worth this. It's not worth the trouble. Okay. It's time to stop wasting time. Where is that red seed? There it is. Alright. No more time wasting. No more. Because I said no more. But when I say no more, I mean no more. Because we got to get some other chaos in there from... You fucking kidding me? Ugh. Really? This fucking thing. Isn't anywhere near me. But it's gonna cause trouble for me just because it decided to activate its boss music and never fucking leave. Okay. It's literally nowhere near me. But because of that, it's causing me to be unable to talk to anyone. Guess we're just going fighting enemies. And I suppose it would be easier to just, like, take it out, but... Fuck that boss. No. How far away do I have to run? For this damn thing to spawn. Fine, I guess we're going to fight. What's if there's two of them? Okay, Ninja. These are at least. There we go. Please let me just talk to him. Damn it. Ah. Where's the elder Coco? I'll go and talk to him up here. I can't even talk to you now. So I think mean, all you have to do whenever you don't want to do a boss or a guardian, whatever the fuck they're called, you just to run around and waste your time until it despawn or decides to stop feeling threatened by your presence when you're not even anywhere near it. I'm seriously gonna have to load and unload the game just for this motherfucker to shut the fuck up. Oh, I can't even save. Maybe dying would do it. You know what? Yeah, let's go and try and do that. Let's go kill myself.
That should do it. Damn it, I'm out of time for this video anyways. <sighs> oh, you fuckhead. I'm so done with this bullshit.